So we're here in Paris uh, to talk about Formula E. There's a panel today who are going to discuss um, fan engagement in Formula E. We've got James Barkley from the Jaguar racing team. We've also got Alain Prost and Alejandro Gag who uh, runs the sport. I think the, the key to successful fan engagement is to open new ways to reach those fans or to give those fans new ways to engage with the sport. Now fan engagement is a completely different thing and fans expect a lot more from the sports they want to follow. Be able to influence the result of the race by voting uh, online or following the race or getting content, a lot more content than the race on your smartphones or on your uh, digital devices. We know that we attract some, let's say, young generation is from me, but uh, you have to be you have to be careful that you you have to open you know the the range of how you attract them you know we are building you know something building a, a project and the concept is, is very good and I think for me uh, and for us uh, at CSN uh, the most important thing is to target the next generation they're the future of this sport what we found is that this next generation are innovators and early adopters and that's very interesting for the brands that uh, would choose to be associated with the sport. They're far more likely to buy VR handsets for instance and the evidence shows that uh, they're two or three times more likely to buy uh, a VR handset and a lot of, of those electronic equipments they're five times more likely uh, to be innovators uh, when purchasing brands. Um, and that therefore makes the sport a very interesting sport, particularly for technologies that, that are very innovative. We're actually doing really well with sponsorship. And the reason is that sponsors and partners today are looking for storytelling, are looking about association to some values, are looking about association to <coughs> sustainability, and are looking about association with innovation and disruption. And the electric revolution is going to be one of those disruptions in the car industry. We have our first batch of electric concept vehicle, the iPace Concept, which was showed in Los Angeles last year at every race uh, from now on. Uh, it's going to be here in Paris this weekend, so it's bringing people closer to what will be the future of battery electric vehicles, as well as understanding the technology behind um, our, not only our race car, but our production cars. Uh, new technology, there are also things like virtual reality and augmented reality feature really uh, in a key part of our fan engagement experience when you come to the e-village. Um, and we take that experience away from Formula E as well to key motor shows and key activities away from race weekends. That's been phenomenally successful um, at key motor shows and activities we've done as a business outside of Formula E weekends and it's something which both we feel really passionate about but our partners really see the benefit of as well.